Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mark Smith has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 15 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by submission due to an arm triangle, Robert Mike Millard. I'm here with the winner, Mike Millard. Mike, congratulations. That was a clinical performance. When we spoke this week, I knew how analytical you were, but right now you're very emotional. Talk me through this. Um, yeah, I, I, I've got a ton of respect for Johan. We're friends, we've trained together before. I hope we can train together again, you know. It's uh, unfortunate we had to have two Canadians duke it out, but I hope that showed high level Canadian MMA and what Canada can be all about. And I hope we inspire the young kids in, in Canada to come uh, pursue their dreams. Well, high level exactly is exactly what that fight was. I mean, you waited on the outside, and then when you had the opportunity to get the takedown, you did it, and then you finished with a head and arm. I mean, was that a submission, and was that a strategy that you planned for in training camp? I like to jam, you know? Yeah. I'm not a guy who wants to come out here and play a, play a song they have pre-recorded or pre-rehearsed. Like, I come out here and I jam, and I like to play, and I like to freestyle. You know, um, getting on top was definitely part of the game plan. Uh, but I, I felt comfortable in the feet. I didn't want to play with fire too long. He's a big, strong guy that hits hard. He's, he's knocked a lot of guys out, so I had to give him some respect in that way. But I felt really comfortable. Uh, I started looking for that head and arm. I heard him kind of gurgle. As he was bridging, he kind of bridged into my shoulder and cut off that carotid artery a little bit tighter. And uh, so I, I, I gave a little bit of extra squeeze on it, and that's all she wrote. Hey, that's what we're here to do. Congratulations. Beautiful submission in the first round. Yeah, of course you can. Okay. Uh, three quick things. Congrats, Jazz. Love you. My teammate. Uh, number two, UFC, please, can we come back to Canada? We need it. We need UFC in Canada. We need to come back to Toronto. I will sell that place out, I swear to God. Okay, and number three, this was an emotional, hard training camp for me. We lost both my grandmother, Dini Malott, and my uncle, Rick Malott. It was really tough on, uh, on the family, and, and uh, I just appreciate my family helping me through this, having the best team in the world in Southern Ontario, helping me out, and uh, I couldn't be happier. Well, my sincere condolences. I'm sure your family are very proud of you, and congratulations on an epic performance. Proper Mike Malott, ladies and gentlemen.